Hi, this is Julia Gulevich from GLOG Software. In this video, I'll teach you how you can process your bounce emails with GLOG EasyMail. The bounce manager in GLOG EasyMail recognizes hard and soft bounce emails, blocked, temporary, spam, and other types of bounce messages. As you know, in GLOG EasyMail account settings, you can type the specific email address to collect bounce messages. This is very convenient if you do not want to mix bounce emails with your regular messages. But if you do not have a specific email account for bounce emails, type your regular email address into this field and the bounce manager will recognize your bounce emails at any case. So, to start processing your bounce emails, click on the Bounced Manager button on GLOG's email toolbar. The Bounced Manager module will open. First of all, you need to create an email account that you will retrieve bounce emails from. Click on Email Server Accounts and then click on Add Email Server Accounts button. Type your account name Type the email address you will retrieve bounce emails from. If you do not have a specific email account for bounces, type your regular email address here. If you remember, I used the bounce at glogsoft.com email address at the return email address. So this is the email address where my bounces will come. So I type bounce at glogsoft.com email address into the email address field. Now type your mail server name, type your login and password. If you use IMAP account, check this box and check the desired options. I uncheck the purge processed messages from server option and I will check the process scene messages option. So the port number is set automatically. Now click test to test the account settings. If the test passes, click OK and click OK again to save the account. Now make sure the checkbox in the active field is checked and click Start. As you see, the program found six bounce emails on my account. In the middle pane, you can see the type of bounced messages the account name, the bounce email address, the message subject, and the SMTP error message. If you click the right mouse button on the bounce email and then click view message, you can see the actual email you sent to the recipient. Directly from the Bounce Manager module, you can add your Bounce email to the exclusion list of the respective group in GLOG email address book. To do this, click on Add to Exclusion list on the toolbar and select the group name. Let's open the address book now and check the exclusion list. As you see, here are my bounce emails. Or you can save your bounce emails to a file. To do this, click on Save Report and select the appropriate option. For example, 
if you select emails only the program will save only the email addresses to a file or you can save all visible fields to a file. If you select this option, the program will save bound type, account name, recipient email address, subject, SMTP error message and message number to a file. Or you can select export wizard. The export wizard allows you save bound emails to different file formats. If you use GLOG Analytics to track emails, you can report the number of bounce emails to your account directly from the Bounce Manager module. Click on GLOG Analytics tab, click Login, wait until the campaigns are loaded. Now select the campaign and click on Report Bounces button. Now your stats on GLOG Analytics will be recalculated with regards to the number of bounce emails and you will get more accurate results. So after you save the bounce emails to a file, you can delete these emails from server. To do this, Click on Delete emails from server. Click Yes. The program deleted your bounce emails from the mail server. So this is how you can process your bounce emails using the Bounce Manager module in GLOG EasyMail.